Welcome everyone, in front of me I have the Nothing Phone 1, so let's set it up. So you're going to be brought to the hello screen, and we'll just tap on the red arrow here. It's going to say connect to network, so I'm going to tap on skip. If you want to connect your SIM card, okay, you see at the bottom here, the SIM card tray, use a SIM ejector in the box, insert your SIM and you'll be good to go. Now it wants me to connect to a network, so I'm going to connect to this network, and I'm just going to enter in my password right here. Smash like for remembering that one off by heart. And once we are connected, it should activate the Google Pixel 6. So it's going to say getting your phone ready. This may take a few moments. So right now, it's going to check if there was a Google account uh, on your Nothing Phone 1. If there was, you will need to enter in a passcode. And if you, for some reason, have a Google account and it's not your account, then that means you got scammed. Just make sure uh, you get a refund as soon as possible. Or ask the old seller if you bought used to remove the passcode. So I'll just give this a couple of seconds here. Okay, here it's going to ask to copy apps and data. So here's what's up. You will need to use the charger, which is inside the box. You connect one end into nothing phone, the other end into your old device, and then you tap on next, follow the on-screen instructions. It's very simple, but for me, I'm going to select don't copy, as I don't want to copy any data to my nothing phone one. So I'll just wait for this uh, information page right here. It's going to ask for the Google account. So when you sign into a Google account, you'll be able to use the Play Store, you'll be able to set up Google Drive, you'll be able to set up all this stuff. So I recommend you sign into a Google account. If you don't have an account, you can always create an account. So I'm going to sign in with my account now. We'll need to agree to the terms and conditions. So I'm going to select I agree. And just give it a couple of seconds for your Google account to sign in to your Nothing Phone 1. So it's going to show us the Google services. So you have the option to back up to Google Drive and use location. So I personally don't back up to Google Drive because I've never seen the uh, use for it. If you have the use, keep it on. Use location, you want to keep this one on. However, allow scanning, turn this one off, as even when your Wi-Fi and Bluetooth is off, it will still scan for networks. I think that is just a waste of battery, and it does waste battery, so you recommend you turn it off. If you would like to help Nothing Phone improve, which they kind of need it, uh, send users in uh, diagnostic data, I do recommend you turn that one on. Uh, install apps and updates, you cannot change this, so we'll just tap on I accept. Now we'll just wait for the next screen to show up, and it's going to say choose your search engine. So I'm going to select Google, because I think that is the best one. Now it's going to ask for the PIN, so I'm just going to say PIN, boom. You also, if you select screen lock options, do you have the uh, prompt for pattern, pin and password, okay. So go boom, boom, and confirm that one. Set up fingerprint ID, I'll tap on set up, and it just says hold to start, so hold in that area, okay, and just slightly move your finger every single time you're trying to get the fingerprint registered. Okay, so I'm just slightly moving, right, because obviously when you try and unlock your uh, nothing phone, you have a slightly different grip every time. I was going to ask if you want the notification content to show up, up to you for that one. Uh, now it's going to show us the Hey Google. So I personally don't like this. I'm going to tap on Skip, Access to Assistant while unlocking. I'm going to select Skip. And so what that means is if your device is locked, you can use the Hey and then you know that trigger word command. And you can say what you would like. Me personally, I have never understood on the, uh, the Google uh, Assistant. I've never understood any voice assistant, but if you enjoy it, then use it. Check out fast with your phone, this is Google Pay. Now Google Pay is now called Google Wallet if you're wondering. Uh, if you tap on next, it will ask you to enter in a card, all that good stuff. I have tutorials on this later, so just subscribe. I'm gonna personally select skip. Then you have all these other options here. You can install uh, recommended apps, uh, change the info in your lock screen, change the wallpaper, add another email, change the font size. But I'm gonna select not thanks, and that's gonna get my phone ready. So this shouldn't take uh, much longer, and then we should be bought uh, to the home screen, or to ask for gesture navigation. So we'll just have to wait for this one to finish. So any moment now, we'll agree to the terms and conditions. Data analysis, definitely share that because they, they need it. And here is the system navigation. So I personally like the free button navigation. Uh, so you have the back, home, and multitasking. If you like gestures with this, uh, this you know, the bar, you can choose that. And now we'll just press the start. And now we are on the home screen. 
of the Nothing Phone One. So I have a bunch of tutorials, how to use Nothing Phone One, tips and tricks for Nothing Phone One. The list will go on. So uh, I have a playlist in the description. I recommend you check that one out right now. With that being said, thanks for watching. See you guys later. Bye bye.